Glad I'm back with my little uh, post and pre form here. This base is a little bit rough right in there. This side I'm gonna flute first. I'm gonna clean this up and wound up with a bevel back over to this side. Probably wound up shortening it up some. But Dressed my point a little bit on the issue stick. Got that little broken off plate right there in that little concrete pot. I'm just going to ignore it. Break this up a little bit better. Then go ahead and bevel it over towards this side right there. Got a good little bevel there, but that's not quite enough. It's not over close enough to this face. I guess you can see look, see if you can see that in the camera. I think you did. That's a lot better. This still could go a little bit closer to this face right here. I mean, it's still sitting back off of this face a good bit. I'm going to bevel it one more time. It's a lot better. Got a little convexity coming down to it, but it's not really sitting all the way on that face. So I'm gonna just lightly grind that now. I'm gonna 
mark my center right where the center is where I want my nipple to be right there because I can't hardly get them centered even with marking them with a pencil like that. Don't knock that flake out that way, then step up a little bit higher. And one more. And one more. Good looking little platform, I think. I'm gonna uh, put me a real sharp tip on my issue stick now. Then I'm gonna just reach right down into this little corner. Right there. Not all the way in the corners. Slightly up toward that nipple, just a little bit. I mean, micro a little bit. And then catch that edge. And push off a little flake. And flip it around, do the same thing right here. Those are your release flakes. That's where that, that loop should release. And then, I'll see you it'll go. That's a little bit of a low spot right there, so you're gonna wanna peel up. And it gets high again, so. Hmm. I don't know. I think this side's gonna go lower than that. It's a little bit thick right there, so that'll help that flute run right under that mass. So I'm gonna go chuck it up in the salt burner jig, and then I'll see if I can film it be included so I'll be back I look like I done broke an ear off hmm. oh yeah I like to cut before I do that I'm gonna grind this is this little flat grinder diamond grinder I'm gonna grind a little flat spot right on that nipple Try to get it square with the flute. You can see how big it is. It's not very big yet. That's a pretty small platform. We'll grind it a little bit more. That ought to do it. That platform's kind of triangular shape. A lot of times they'll be uh, more rectangular. But the, both sides of these flakes just come off at an angle there. I don't think it'll matter because most of the pressure is going to be right on the back side of where this grinding is. That's where the pressure is blue plied that makes it release right there below that. Make sure it's square. It's hard to see. Pretty square. I'm gonna grind the tip just lightly too so it won't sink into the antler none. When it gets pressed into the little anvil. So, so I don't know if 
you look from this side too, if you can see that, that platform is just down below center line between them two ears. But I'll be back.